Hey everyone, welcome. I am Crystal. If you're new or returning Yarny Cat, welcome. So today on Yarny Talk Thursday, I have a finished hand spun yarn. I have some yarn that I'm spinning in progress and I have a whip uh, plus a little Happy Meal. Um, gonna be very quick. So this is my finished hand spun yarn. Um, I was also spinning this on my Friday night live sit and spin. This is three bobbins worth and it's 652 yards. This is Merino. It's a 23 micron wool and it's very soft. This is for me. Um, so I did spin something for myself, but where they connected made like a striped barber pole effect. Um, I love it. Super soft. Um, so I have also been spinning this one that's on the nitty naughty. This is one full bobbin. This is for Dawn Aaron Loving Hands Creations. I already have a another bobbin kind of almost half full. Um, and uh, my whip I have started the Bag o Day crochet along uh, for the shawl. Now, very quickly, I am using a one weight. She had suggested uh, she did hers in a three. I am doing mine in a one because I am so short. I'm four nine. If I made it in a three weight, it's going to be like 70 inches long or the top is 70 something inches. It will hang past my knees, so I'm I'm trying to make it a lot smaller. Um, but I got the first, I think, six rows done. And this is 60% cotton, 40 acrylic, so I am going to uh, steam block it. Um, but I, am, I have two cakes of this, so I should have enough. This has 918 yards. It is... Uh, Rainbow Rhapsody. I, I think I either got it at the Hobby Lobby clearance last year or I was gifted it. I know I got one of these, but I think, uh, yeah. Anyway, so it is by Yarn Bee. It's called Slate Divide. Uh, the Slate Divide. That's the colorway. Um, white, pink, and then a marled, a light and dark pink, and then it goes to gray and dark gray marled. And then solid gray. So I have two of those. I started with the middle with the white. But it will kind of stretch out. So um, let's see. I still am working on that yellow shawl. Uh, I haven't touched it. Um, okay, so I got also got some happy mail from Melanie. Lethalia's little hook. Um so backtracking yesterday we went and seen my aunt and took her some clothes we got her into the rehabilitation center uh she got out of the hospital tuesday morning she's doing good so we were tired by the time we got home so we did i did not film the video opening it uh but thank you melanie she did uh send a little card and it says, Crystal, just thanks for being my friend. The bracelet, watch, and candy are for you. The tin sign and prayer cards are for Mama. And the yarn is for Mom. I hope you all are well and happy and safe. Love and hugs to you all, Mel and Puppers. So, thank you, Mel. Um, some of the stuff I do not have, but, uh, yes. So, she had, had made some... What did she call them? Some homemade raspberry gummies that reformed into one mass, she said. So uh, that's what this is. It is homemade raspberry gummy that melted into one clump. Um, so I'm going to have a time trying to get that out of there and eating it. But she sent a little bag of Easter candy, m and Starburst, Twix, Three Musketeers, which she knows I like, and a Snickers. Um, this is... Ooh, the sign that the the tin sign that she sent Momo, my soul is fed with needle and thread because she's a seamstress. So, um, 
my mom has the yarn, but I will insert a picture here. And then she sent to me, I am not going to say this on camera. I'll let you read it. It is a bracelet that is Morse code that says this. So I thought that was kind of cool. Thank you, Mel. And then I know what this watch is. It is a pocket watch. And these round things on here are related to Doctor Who. So, and then the back is very decorative. But it opens up. So, thank you. Um, and it does have a chain. So, I and, and also she sent prayer cards, but my grandmother is not here and it's in a room. Um, so that is actually it. It's very quick, short, Yarny Talk Thursday. I do have some uh, pictures for Yarny Cat Spotlight. So some of them might actually be doubles from a couple of times before. I couldn't remember if I used them or not. So if you do see doubles, I'm sorry about that. Um, so other than that, that's all I have. I've been spinning yarn a lot lately, so I don't have a lot of projects going. I've just been enjoying spinning. Um, but I do, I do love this. I do, and I have more of the wool. Um, and I got two orders I got to do, which I'm working on Dawn's and, um, Diana D's is after dawn. So yes, I am, I am loving it. And, um, I guess that is it for now. I hope y'all have a wonderful day. Take care, stay safe, and I'll see y'all later and enjoy Yarny Cat Spotlight. Bye everyone. Thank you.